nothing to do with how tall or how short you are because your inseam is what matters. So you're going to need to get, if you have one, a fabric measuring tape. If not, go get a ribbon or a string. Don't get a hard ruler. Get something like a piece of yarn, a piece of ribbon, something that's soft and flexible, and we're gonna find your inseam today. Might be in two parts, and I hate that, and I'm sorry, but I want to show you on me as well as how to measure. So the first thing you're going to do is an inseam starts, you don't measure on yourself. So the first thing you do is go get a pair of pants um, if you're looking for jeans, get a pair of jeans and not dress pants because they fit differently. Get a pair of jeans that is the perfect length for you, that you absolutely love, or maybe like, oh, if I took a half an inch off this, something that fits you really, really well that you know, you know, you like the length of, or it's perfect to wear with boots or whatever at that length. And then what you're going to do is you are going to Pick your pants up, lay them down on the ground, whatever. A lot of people do the whole, let me fold the pants like this and put it from here. I literally like to hold the seam of the crotch. I think it's a lot more accurate. I'm no seamstress. I'm not a professional clothing designer. So maybe this is wrong, but this works for me. Put your, so I've got them like this, right? So that's the waist. Put your measuring tape or your ribbon or your string at the seam of the crotch. And you are going to, this is why you want it flexible. You can lay it down on the ground and do this too. But you want to take it all the way down. Now, these jeans then have an inseam. Oops, it's upside down. 29 and a half. These are my personal jeans that I own. This inseam is 29 and a half. So now, let me show you in the mirror how that looks. If you measured using a ribbon or a string, lay the ribbon or string out on a hard surface like a table, and then use a measuring stick to find the length that works. Okay, we're going to part two. Real quick though, that's how you measure the inseam of those pants. Now that doesn't necessarily mean it's the perfect inseam for you. So go to part two. <laughs> 